Hello's internet. It's been a while. I'm Ray Sapsu have nine and uh, welcome to a uh, video that um I just wanted to be like making for um reasons. Uh so um I wanna bring up a fact that um that I've known of for um quite some time. Um and I want to ask you, and if you guys have noticed in most of my update videos, when you actually see my face, I'm kind of looking around, like, just looking at other things, looking around, not paying attention to what I'm doing right here. Um, the uh, reason for that is, um, because of, uh, uh um, I have ADHD, um, I can't focus for very long, it's kind of hard for me to do it, but it's not like a simple ADD thing, um, ADD stands for Attention Deficit Disorder, for me, it's Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder, so I'm a bit more hyper, more, a bit more energy than normal, um, I've I've been known to have this. I forget exactly what age I was and when I was actually diagnosed with this. Um. Um. I coughs. Um. Okay. Um. Um. Uh. But yeah, I can't focus hard for me, um, but, to all of it, I, um, I, um, I want to say, I was put on medication, um, a few years ago, and I was taken off it, because uh, of the side effect of whether it made me drowsy, which, I didn't like it, um, and I didn't really like taking the medication. And, um, it, uh, later at some point, I never ate. I didn't eat anything. I, if I did eat something, it was, like, this much or something like that. I didn't eat very much. It was very worrying, and I was never hungry. It was... I just didn't eat, and I don't know, but, um, I don't take medication anymore. The medication I was on was Tratera, and it doesn't really matter. Um, it doesn't, and, yeah, I'm not, I don't take medication anymore. I'm just full-fledged mind here, um, but there are good things to what I have, and, um, one of the things is, for me, because I, because I get, I get, I get unfocused easily, or I at least probably get bored of something really easily, I'm just like, I look around for like certain things, sometimes I can get a full look of, of a room, and know exactly where everything is, easily, it's, um, it just kind of helps out with it, and it's actually kind of fun. Uh, well, it's actually kind of cool because um, when most people ha would have trouble finding in a room, it takes me a little bit, like, I don't know exactly how long. If they're, like, looking for plates or something, like, in a new place, I'll know exactly. If I've seen where they were. I'll know exactly where they were the last time, and they don't know. And in classrooms, I kind of... Okay, this is where everything is, and, um, but, it, uh, it's kind of, well, not essentially gets in the way, um, it can at some times, and it sucks at some point some points and 
<coughs> and, uh, I'm sorry, I got, um, don't feel so good in the chest, so, <coughs> excuse me, um, uh, so my voice is a bit deeper, a bit more quiet than normal, um, but, I find it hard for me to multitask, and it's, and it can be hard for me in my Let's Play videos. Um, I have a hard time, because, um, I love doing my Let's Play videos. I love entertaining you guys with gameplay and commentary, stuff like that. And, um, it gets in the way sometimes because of certain times where, um, like, I'm getting into the game and I forget to talk, and it just makes things hard. And it's, um, kind of hard for me to, well, write a bit of music sometimes because I just can't focus on it, and it just becomes a huge problem, and, um... I but yeah, um but if I actually was given a choice because I didn't really get a choice of taking the medication the first time. Um what I've done the meditation medication meditation. I already meditate sometimes. Um depends on it's called sleep. But if I had a choice, would I do the medication? Probably not. No. I would stay the way I am. Um, now, essentially, it's not like I'm going to be like this forever. I can outgrow the ADHD. Or it could stick with me for the rest of my life. It all depends on certain things. Um, but... When it comes to this, I get a bit frustrated when um, people say, oh, this person's suffering from it, or something like that. It's people with ADD or ADHD aren't suffering. They are different in a way. Their minds work differently, some because our minds work faster than others. Ours moves faster. We can be more creative in certain ways that it's a, it can it can be a good thing but it can also be a bad thing because you're trying to talk to someone and there's someone like no you can't focus on two things at once sometimes and it gets in the way of certain things and it um, makes it kind of hard um, I'm not on medication I um, just full mind again I think I let's see can't focus. Um, <coughs> ow. Um, um, but, come on, focus. God dang it. Um, doing this Let's Play stuff does bode as a problem for me because it's not like I don't like to do it. I love doing Let's Play stuff. It just Find it, find it hard for me to do it. But when I made the channel, my second Let's Play channel, Game Bandits, I was um, able to mo focus more because I'm playing with someone and talking with someone that's right beside me throughout the whole video, and it just makes it easier for me to focus on doing everything the way I need to do it. And it's it helps me when I'm talking with someone to kind of keep my focus. I need all I wouldn't say I need it. Um, but the suffering thing, no, we aren't suffering. If you ask me, we're just it's just a gift that we were taken, that we were given. So it makes us different. It doesn't really matter. But there's one comment that just irritated me and. This was a few years ago. Um, um, the person had said, 
my that the person's mother has ADHD, and that person thinks it's rubbing off on is contagious, and they're getting it because they spend time with their it was either the mother or the father. Um, I want to say this. That was it. It was a stupid comment, and I'm not trying to be mean, but. It's not contagious, it's something you're born with. It's a mental thing, and I don't It's not essentially a disorder, though I do call it that, <laughs> because of... I like being technical sometimes. Um... It's just who I am. A lot of people would have it. It's, um very hard for me to uh, keep focus on things and like after I was taken off the medication medication the first time my grades <laughs> plummeted and it was it sucked um, later I was put back on the medication and my grades did come up a little bit uh, the medita medication kind of helped a bit it, but and like it, it was just didn't like it. It was not a good time for me. Um, but I'm beginning to learn how to control it. Sometimes it slips, like you would see. Um, um, I can't. So one of the things about it is I can't stay still for a long period of time. I have to move a body part or something. In the middle of class, you'll see my foot like just j like just jiggling, the back of it going, the back of it going crazy, and um, or I'm just tapping like that. Um, I think it's just something that helps me keep doing this. And my handwriting isn't the greatest. I can't write cursive, not because I'm I have an inability an ability of doing it. It's just that um, I just can't focus hard enough to actually work on my handwriting, and I really, um, I wouldn't say it's a bad thing, it, um, because it's not, it's just me. So, don't call people with ADHD or ADD. Differently, different in a bad way. Because we're not very different. We're exactly like you. We just at least have a different set of minds. Most people, scientists or something like that, have ADD or ADHD, and then it's helpful to be creative. And it's just there. I can't get rid of it. I can't grow it, but I can't get rid of it. <sighs> yeah. So, I kind of wanted to make this not, not this video, but yeah. I don't know the exact reason why I wanted to bring this up and post it on the world, but that's what I'm doing. So, I will. See you guys in the next video, which will hopefully be a new Resident Evil video, maybe. I'll see you guys next time.